we have here today is a 1971 BMW. It's a 75 or an R75 5. Uh, this bike has 16,000 original miles on it. Uh, it was a barn find and I've done some things to it, got it running and um, it's all original. I can't see anything that's not original on it. Uh, it has the crash bars on it. Yeah, I put a brand new battery in it, interstate battery. It is missing each side cover. Both sides are missing the side cover. Other than that, the bike appears to me to be all stock and an original, and it really runs super. Um, the original mufflers are in very nice shape, as you can see. There's a small scuff right here. It, the chrome is very nice on them. It has the old tires on it. It's got the aluminum rims. The tires should obviously be changed because they are old and dry rod, but they hold air. Uh, everything works on it, all the lights, signals, horn, everything works. Uh, you can see the original paint on the tank is in super nice condition, as well as the fenders. There's some rust uh, patina on the frame, uh, you know, in this area, some rusty bolts. Uh, this bike needs to go to the next step. The, limp, the wheels are aluminum. Uh, the spokes show some rust on them. But, uh, the seat also, I would say, is uh, the foam is, is sort of worn down. It could use a new seat cover. Um, again, walking our way around the bike, um, the carburetors have been gone through. It starts instantly. Uh, the fork boots are in nice condition. I would say that the, the headlamp appears it might uh, need repainted. It's got a dent back here in the back of it. And you can see it's just not the same color as the bike. It's a little roll right here. Uh, but that's the worst of the damage on the bike. If you look at the fenders, you can see the condition of them. Um, those are plastic fenders is what they used on the bike. Uh, the tank is super clean inside. We'll show you. It looks very original. I don't think it's ever been coated. It looks like the original primer that they used from BMW. The uh, speedometer tachometer Actually, it just rained very hard, and there's a, there's a little bit of fog in it, but it, it clears up. And the original mile is showing, again, at 16,724 miles. The speedometer and attack both work. That seems to be an issue with these bikes from what I read, and uh, they are both working fine. So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and take a test drive. Uh, this muffler is nearly perfect. There's a few stain spots on it, but you can see that's the original mufflers. And again, uh, I think this bike taking the next step would be a beautiful bike, uh, low mileage. I'm going to go ahead and open the seat. I do not have a key for this, but it's a push button and it opens the seat. And um, we'll show you in the steel videos, I have the, the uh, box that fits in here with the original tool kit. Uh, we'll show you that in the other pictures. All right, but the bottom of the seat, uh, not beautiful, but it's a solid pan. And again, I would think that somebody would want to reupholster the seat. So there you are. I'm going to go ahead and start it and take it for a ride. Again, it's just a typical BMW that just starts instantly and idles nice. All the lights and everything work. So I'm going to go ahead and start it. Uh, push down on the starter button. See how easy it start. Just sit there and idles nice. Center stand and the side stand are both complete.
it back in neutral. You can hear it idle. It just sits there and putts really nicely. 